few pews CNC here, and I wanted to show off these aluminum mag base plates that I'm making. These are 7075, and they are made for Glock, uh, the double stack 9mm magazines. And you can see they are a slightly different profile than the OEM, and that just gives you a little bit of extra to grab onto there uh, if you do need to strip it. Uh, and also it, it looks cool. So I wanted something that just looked a little different than what is currently out there. So there you can see it in there. You have a little bit to grab onto if you would have to strip that magazine because it was stuck in there. Uh, so I just put all these on. Uh, these are all brand new magazines. I'm going to give these to a buddy to do product pictures for me. Um, and I thought, man, I should have made a video just showing how those go on. So I have, this is one of my range mags here. You can see it's nice and dirty. So we're going to pop this off and put, uh, we'll probably put the red one on since this is a range mag. So the way that works, you have this little area right there. You're going to want to get something uh, that is nice and sturdy. I usually just use an Allen wrench. This is a eighth inch Allen wrench. We're going to stick that down in there. We're going to depress the spring. And when we stick it down in there, we're going to kind of pull it forward. And that's going to pop this off. You have the little tabs there that capture it. So see if I can do this and capture it on camera. All right, so let's put that down in there, and then if we just pull it forward, now these have popped out. I need to get some better lighting. So now that just comes off. You're going to want to leave your thumb over top of it in case things go to fly out because there is a spring. So here we go. So the way it goes up back in, it's pretty easy. You just put that back. You're going to take your little base pad there, get it lined up with the spring, and press everything down like so. And then this is going to just go back on the same way the other one came off. You're going to slide it on there. Now this, because of these little tabs here, since this is aluminum versus plastic, uh, the plastic gives, the aluminum does not. So it is a little harder to get on. So let's see if we can do this. There you go. When you do that, uh, you might notice that it shaves a little bit of the plastic off. And that's fine if that happens. But that is how it goes on. Pretty easy. So the red and the black, it's red anodized, and these are black anodized. This is the, obviously a shiny finish, and this is more of a matte finish. Uh, but these are available on eBay, the black and the red. And then I just had these guys Cerakoted, OD Green, Sniper Gray, and FDE. So I'm going to be working on a batch of those. Uh, but if you want to get one, go over to eBay, Pew Pew CNC. Uh, you'll get the mag base plate. And I also just got these stickers in. So you'll get a sticker with it as well.